Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. When I returned to Fort Dongard, Isran told me that he needed to speak to me and ask me to follow him. Things are about to get a lot more difficult. All right, Cyrus, let's go. Let's see what Isran wants. Dark and dusty in here. I'm conjuring candlelight. Isran. Look, this the Elder Scroll. While you were away. I'm guessing. Where did it come from? Says it's got something really important to say to you. You brought me here to see an Elder so Scroll? We've it. got it back? You probably weren't expecting oh, to see me oh, again. Wait, oh, wait. I Can didn't I help you? see you standing there. I'm sorry, I was so focused on you the Elder Scroll. You probably weren't expecting to see me again. No, I, I wasn't, actually. What are you doing here? And why did you bring the Elder Scroll? I'd rather not be here either, but I needed to talk to you. It's important, so please just listen before uh, your friend right. here loses his if patience. If I must. It's... Well, it's about me and the Elder Isn't Scroll that was buried with me. What about the scroll? The reason I had it and why I was down there. It all comes back to my father. I'm guessing you figured this part out already, but my father's not exactly a good person. Oh, really? Even by vampire standards. Huh. He wasn't always like that, though. There was... a turn. He stumbled onto this obscure prophecy and just kind of lost himself in it. What do you mean, lost himself? He just became absorbed. Obsessed. He was kind of sick, actually. The prophecy said that vampires would no longer need to fear the sun. For someone who fancied himself as vampire royalty, that's pretty seductive. Anyway, my mother and I didn't feel like inviting a war with all of Tamriel, so we tried to stop him. That's why I was sealed away with the scroll. And what does this have to do with the Dawn Guard? I'm sorry. I had heard there were vampire hunters here. What? How dare you? I thought you? they might want to know about a vampire plot to enslave the rest of the world. Was I wrong? The nerve of you. So, you're trying to tell us that a vampire is coming to the lair of vampire hunters so that you can help us. You really expect us to believe that? That was the plan, yes. What? Assuming the rest of them can trust a vampire. Are you serious? Come on, I'll need you to help convince them. Really? Do you see those faces? Do you really think they're going to listen to me? Look at them. They'll sooner cut my throat as yours if I speak on your behalf. All right. I'll see what I can do. Wait here. Is Ran? All right, you've heard what it has to say. It? Now tell me, is there any reason I shouldn't kill this blood-sucking fiend right now? Well, there's no reason I can think of. I'd like to kill the blood-sucking fiend myself. It's the decree of Stendar, and yet... 
for some reason I find that I can't, that I have no option to destroy a vampire when it's my sworn duty to do so. So I think we're both going to have to set our hatred aside and try to see the larger picture. Set my hatred aside? Yes, yes. Not a chance. What? It's what, what? keeps me but strong. I thought... Oh, well, I, I can understand that. You don't trust her. Fine. I don't trust her either. I don't even trust me. And I don't believe her. You better know what you're doing. I don't. It can stay for now. It? But if it so much as lays a finger on anyone here, I'll hold you responsible. Got it. You hear me? What is it? Don't feel like a guest, because you're not. You're a resource. You're an asset. In the meantime, don't make me regret my sudden outburst of tolerance and we generosity. Stopped. What is it? Because if you do, your friend here is going to pay for it. Thank you for your kindness. Uh, what can I'll I remember do for it the friend? next time I'm feeling hungry. I take it I'm that friend. So, in case you didn't notice the giant thing on my back, I have the Elder Scroll with me. I'm sorry, but Whatever that's all says, I noticed. It will have something that can help us stop my father. Really? But, of course, neither of us can read it. Wait, what? <laughs> so, your cat. All right. Who can? Well, the moth priests are the only ones I've heard of who can do it. They spend years preparing before they start reading, though. Not that it helps us anyway, because they're all half a continent away. In Cyrodiil. Some Imperial scholar arrived in Skyrim a few days ago. I was staking out the road when I saw him pass by. Maybe that's your moth priest. Do you know where he's staying now? No, and I'm not going to waste men looking. We're fighting a war against your kind, and I intend to win it. I'm going to stand over find here him, on this side. Try talking to anyone who'd meet a traveler. Innkeepers and carriage drivers in the big cities, maybe. But you're on your own. Any idea how you're going to find a moth priest? Skyrim's a pretty Me? big place. Me? I thought you were supposed to be helping us. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm gonna go across the room and, and speak with her. Can I help you? I knew it would come to Any this. Any idea one day. how you're going to find a moth priest? I knew. Skyrim's a pretty and big no place. One believed. Where would a moth priest actually go? Well, back before I, you know. The College no, of I don't was know. the first place I'd think to go for any kind of magic or historical thing. Okay. The wizards know about all kinds of things that people probably shouldn't know about. Actually, now that I think of it, I'm going to come along with oh, you. Oh, I don't think so. I've been really so. wanting to get out and explore a bit. Well, do so on your own. I do have some questions, though, for you. What do you know about Elder Scrolls? I mean, as much as anyone. Not a lot. Yes, that's You'd not saying anything. You'd figure a couple anything. hundred years locked away with one would have given me some insight, but no. Turns out you don't learn much from just sleeping with something. Well, some can through the process of osmosis, but I suppose that didn't happen in this case. So I guess we'll just have to keep looking for that moth priest. I guess so. And you're staying here. I'll be here. Yes. All right, Cyrus, let's go. I am not, as a Vigilant of Stendar, going to be seen traveling with a vampire. I mean, it just doesn't make any sense at all. Let's see, there's a chest here. Maybe there's some things we could use. Gold. More gold. All right. Be on your guard at all times. Thank you. Avoid sleep if you can. Sleep is for the weak. I'll keep that in mind. Is this your companion here? You no, I would have come to this one day. I have no I judgment, knew. Isran. It's all and right. No one believed. Yes. I wish you both the best. All right, let's Even go. With all my preparations, Cyrus. we can't be too careful. The monsters could strike us at any moment. Isran seems 
quite salty right now. I think it's time for us to get out of here. I'm not sure he wanted me to see his lover in his bed. But we can keep it a secret if it must be kept that way. All right, let's go. All right, we've had to stop here in Windhelm to catch a carriage to Winterhold since I've never been there. Yes. My I carriage do. is the safest way to travel. All right, I'll have to go along with what you're saying. By the way, have you seen a moth priest? It's one of them imperial scholars, right? Old man with a gray robe. Well, yes, that sounds about right. Have you seen him? Might be that I have, but I can't say for sure. I got enough troubles on my mind just trying to scrape by out here. Please. It's very important that I find him. Now that I think on it, I did see your priest. They tried to hire me for a trip to Dragonbridge. Dragonbridge? I told him that ain't one of my stops. All right. Then we may not need to go to... Wait, who? Cyrus, what are you... D okay, that, I don't like that expression. See ya. Get away from me. Can I help you? Really? Cyrus! Good morning. We're at... We're, we're in... Stop. There's company here. It? There's people here. Um, Alf... Hmm? Alfarin. Yes? Yes. So, I think that's all. Mm -hmm. We will head to Dragonbridge and not go to Winterhold. If that's all right with you, Good Cyrus. Morning. Let's go. Right, here we are. Dragonbridge. Hello, excuse me, sir. Sir. Keep walking, stranger. I just wanted to ask if you knew anything about a moth priest visiting Dragonbridge. A moth priest? <laughs> yes. I'm sorry, but I don't know anything about that. Try asking one of the guards. All right, thank you. Until next time. Hmm. And wouldn't you know it, there's never a guard around when you need one. Ah, well. I suppose I'm mistaken. Guard? I have a lot of respect for the Restoration School. Skyrim could use more healers. Yes, I quite agree. And they should not have been led by a fraud that really knew next to nothing about Restoration. Anyhow... Do you know anything about a moth priest visiting Dragonbridge? Oh, so that was a moth priest then. He rode through town not long ago with an escort of soldiers. They didn't stop, just headed south, across the Dragonbridge. All right, thank you. I'll take my leave then. Cyrus, let's go. <laughs> I meant to ask you, Cyrus, if you're all right with me wearing these paladin, this paladin armor. I know I haven't earned it yet, but given the circumstances, thank you. Thank you for your blessing. All right. I hope one day to earn the right to wear this armor. I'm here to help. All right, this way is south. If this Wait. cold numbs my fingers any worse, I'll scarcely be able to hold a weapon. What's this? Look at all this blood and these dead bodies. 
Need something? You have questions? I don't. Well, not for you. Imperial soldier. It must have been one of the Moth Priest guards. Oh, no. It can't be. A vampire. A note from Malchus. I have new orders for you. Prepare an ambush just south of Dragonbridge. Take the Moth Priest to Forebear's holdout for safekeeping until I can break his will. He's been captured. Even the horse was slain. All right, we need to get after that moth priest immediately. There's no telling how long he can survive the torture of vampires. Should his will be broken, there's no telling what the consequences of that will be. Look. Puddles of blood. Is this the moth priest blood? If so, he's badly injured. It's this way, Cyrus. Yes, four bears hold out. And plenty of blood. Get ready. We've stopped. What is it? I can't help myself picking these ingredients. I know I should stop. Is it a vampire? I think so. I I feel darkness emanating from him. Maybe a thrall. There's more. I see more bodies moving. And that curtain, that barrier. What are they up to? Vigilant, are you ready? animals ahead. Death hounds. What was that? Come on. Stendar, take you.
Yes, it was a vampire's thrall. Still someone else. Ah! Oh, over there. Did you hear something? No, the thrall. his guards. Huh? Look, it's the Maw Priest. By the might of Stendar, I can't penetrate this barrier. This is an orc vampire. Interesting. Amulet of the Gargoyle. While wearing this amulet, your, your summon gargoyle spell summons an additional gargoyle. Well, I'll certainly sell that off. A waystone. This may be what we need. Nightshade extract. Make sure I take plenty of this dust so that I can make more cure disease potions. Hmm. Necklace of the Betrayer. Sneak attacks deal 15% more damage. Scaled armor of the Squire. Light armor is 15 points more effective, and this is quite heavy. Why would heavy armor have a light armor enchantment? That doesn't make any sense. Um, I'm going to give this to you, Cyrus. We've stopped. What is it? I need to trade some things. Sure thing. Oh, wait, I still have my, my old armor. Oh, no, you're carrying my old armor. We haven't had a chance to sell anything yet.
All right, we'll just get rid of that in the meantime. Let's go. Yes. All right, so I have a waystone. I need to figure out what to do with it. I suppose placing it here might be the answer. What you're doing by Stendar's might. I command you. Wait, stop. I yield. That that wasn't me. You were fighting. Really? Who was it then? I could see through my eyes, but I could not control my actions. Come on, he's dropped down Thank below. Thank you for breaking that foul vampire's hold over me. Well, I suppose it was my pleasure. I owe you a debt for the timely rescue. Are you all right? Uh, I'm quite all right, thanks to you. Dexian Evicus is my name. I'm a moth priest of the White Gold Tower. I'm These Zach vampires Juan. claimed they had some purpose in store for me. Really? They wouldn't say what. Probably hoping to ransom me, the fools. Well... I know why they needed you, because we need you for the same purpose. You do? All <laughs> right then, enough mysteries. Yes, enough. We're called the Dawn Guard, and we need you to read an Elder Scroll. You have an Elder Scroll? Remarkable. If my knowledge of history serves me, I recall that the Dawn Guard was an ancient order of vampire hunters. I will be happy to assist you with your Elder Scroll. Just tell me where I need to go. Oh, well, thank you. Another kind man. And now I can tell that you are filled with light. Light which had been extinguished by the darkness of these vampires. It is my pleasure to work alongside you. You can find us at Fort Dawnguard near Stendar's Beacon. Very well. I'll hurry on my way there before more of those vampires turn up. Please do. All right. Vigilant, it's time for us to get out of here. Let's go. We'll see you later, Moth Priest. Got to keep alert. We don't want to get caught napping like the Vigilance did. Ouch. That hurt. <laughs> At least I wasn't there. Isran. Wait, is that the Moth Priest? He's here already? <laughs> I'm impressed you could find a Moth Priest so quickly. Well, you haven't seen the full extent of what I can do. <laughs> I'm impressed you could find a Moth Priest so quickly. Does he have the scroll? Is everything ready? For the reading? Yeah. Just let the old man know when you're ready. My trip to Skyrim has become quite the adventure. <laughs> I bet it has. All right, I think we're ready. But I'm glad you made it here safely. Ah, my rescuer. <laughs> it's good to see you again. Ah. Have my companions made you feel welcome? It's not exactly the hospitality I'm used to. Uh oh. But your man Isra has seen to my needs well enough. Uh, okay. Well, at and least there's might that. might I add, this is a remarkable fortress. It is. I have colleagues back home that would love to study this place in detail. I'm sure. Are you prepared to read the Elder Scroll? 
Oh, most certainly. Let's find out what secrets the scroll can tell. Yes, now, let's. Uh, if everyone what? will please be quiet, I must concentrate. All right, I see a stand back. before me. An image of a great bow. I know this weapon. It is Oriel's bow. Now a voice whispers, saying, Among the knight's children, a dread lord will rise. In an age of strife, when dragons return to the realm of men, darkness will mingle with light, and the night and the day will be as one. The voice fades Need and the something? words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. Need the something? secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. I think there is more to the prophecy Need recorded in other scrolls. Yes, I see them now. Will you go away? One We're contains busy. the ancient Shh, secrets of the dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. What do you need? My vision darkens, and I see no more. To know the complete prophecy, we must have the other two scrolls. I must rest now. The reading has made me weary. Come on, old man. You should get some rest. Do you have a moment to talk? Oh. All right. I suppose. Do you have a moment to talk? Sure. What's up now? That moth priest, Dexian. He said we needed two other Elder Scrolls. I think I know where we can start looking. All right. Well, why didn't you say something earlier? Half the people in your little crew would just as soon kill me as talk to me. <laughs> that doesn't exactly make me want to open up. I got a warmer welcome from my father, and that's saying something. But you must understand that we're vampire hunters. I'm a vigilant of Stendar. You're an abomination in our eyes. To allow you to continue to exist goes against every principle, every fiber of our being. Does Harkon even care about you anymore? You know, I've asked myself the same thing. I hoped that if he saw me, he might feel something again. But I guess I don't really factor in at this point. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. Hmm, I'm just that's harsh. A means to an end. Or an Elder Scroll. So, tell me, where is this Elder Scroll? We need to find my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. You said she didn't know where. She. You said you didn't know where she went. The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. But the way she said it, some place he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. it. Sounds like she was being cautious. Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. Oh boy. Besides, I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? Really? I know nothing about you or your family, and suddenly you're turning to me for suggestions? <laughs> so, maybe she was sealed away like you? I don't think so. She said she wanted so why to stay ask me? in case the situation was resolved. It had to be one of us, and, well, she's so much more powerful than I am. Oh, boy. It just made sense for her to be out here. Anything else? How about Castle Volkahar? Wait, that almost makes sense. There's a courtyard in the castle. I used to help pretend a garden there. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too peaceful. Isn't that pretty risky, staying around the castle? Oh, absolutely. But my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but... It's worth a look. They aren't going to let us use the front door. True. But I know a way we can get to the courtyard without arousing suspicion. 
There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. I think that's our way in. All right, but I have some things that I need to do first. Don't let me stand in your way then. Oh, you won't. I'll Trust be at the dock me. Whenever you're ready. Thank you. Good day. Nerve. She's very pushy too. All right, Cyrus. We need to make some preparations. And then I'm not even sure what we're up to next. <laughs>